Jana, thanks. Right now, developing news in Springfield involving the latest arrest in a string of shootings in the city. Western Mass News reporter Glenn Kittle joining us live tonight in studio with those latest details. Glenn. Chris, 21-year-old Tyree Shakespeare was arrested on Sunday in connection with last Wednesday's double shooting where a woman was injured and a man was killed. New information from Springfield Police reveals Shakespeare's criminal past. He was charged in an armed home invasion in December of 2020. He was then released on bail in order to wear a GPS ankle monitor as a condition of his release. In March 2021, while awaiting trial, police say Shakespeare removed his ankle bracelet. Three months later, in June 2021, the Hamden District Attorney's Office picked him up for violating his pretrial parole. In August of 2022, police say a judge set bail for Shakespeare at $5,000, and he was once again ordered to wear a GPS ankle monitor. But in May of 2023, police say Shakespeare removed his GPS ankle bracelet once again. And just one month later, Springfield police say Shakespeare committed the double shooting on the corner of Ashman and Adam Street, which left one person dead and another injured. We spoke with Springfield City Councilor LeVar Click Bruce, who tells Western Mass News the city is currently looking for solutions to end a string of shootings over the past three weeks. I do know one of the rap sheets of one of those individuals that created uh, murder, murdered someone, uh, cut off a bracelet. So we need cooperation from the from the courts as well. Um, also creating a safe haven places um, for our citizens to, to feel safe. Coming up at 6, what Mayor Dominic Sarno has to say about the city's ongoing crackdown on gun violence. Reporting live in the studio, Glenn Kittle, Western Mass News.